Hi guys, it's Krista from Playing With A Purpose. And this morning I'm gonna show you a quick Christmas science related activity. And it's using items you probably already own. If you're new here, my name is Krista and I'm a childcare provider for up to five children. And on my channel, you'll find tips and tricks, all things related to childcare, shopping hauls, and the odd family vlog. So I made these two different activity boxes. So this activity, the children have to discover whether or not the item is magnetic or not magnetic. To set up this activity, I just found different items around the room and I tried to choose some Christmas related items. And I also added green and red goggles to make it more festive. And so the children are just gonna play with this box and try to discover which items are magnetic and which items are not magnetic. Which is not magnetic. Which is not? No. The candy, okay. This is magnetic. That is. Okay, let's do something. Let's put all the not magnetic on this side and all the magnetic on this side. This is not magnetic. This is not magnetic. This is magnetic. This is magnetic. Is that magnetic? Yeah. Yeah, can I have that one? We'll put it here. Okay, what about the rock? Is the rock magnetic? No. No, can you put it on that side? Okay, what about Santa? Is he magnetic? No. No, you can put him with the rock. What about the pipe cleaner? I take you. This is the pipe cleaner. Is it magnetic? Yes. Yes, it is. Good job. What about the candy cane? Yeah, thank you. All right. What about the candy? It's not making. No? What about the pine cone? It's not magnetic. It's not magnetic? What about the bell? It's magnetic. Good job. What about the train? It's not magnetic. Are you sure? It's not. It's not? You discovered something. There's parts that are and there are parts that are not magnetic. Which part of the train is magnetic? This. Which? This. That part. Try this one. <gasps> Yay! Is Santa magnetic? I hope you enjoyed this simple Christmas science activity. I'm Krista with Playing With A Purpose. I'll see you next time.